channel. I'm eating a sandwich. Hello, sandwich. I'm eating a turkey sandwich. It looks like this. It's very plain. Nothing's going on. Carlos is in the shower right now, and then we are going to head to Target. I'm so excited. We are going to Target to grab a few things. We are putting up some shelves up into tomorrow's vlog. Yeah, in tomorrow's vlog. But because our couch is coming, Today, we gotta clear all the boxes in the living room and that is going to be empty. Someone left a comment in a previous vlog last week and said, I would love to see a vlog where you guys just clean all the boxes and unbox and clear out the living room. Like she was like, that's gonna be so satisfying to watch. And I was like, girl, I got you. We are gonna do today. So if you guys are interested in unboxing and B-roll and just seeing things kind of like disappear, today's going to be your vlog. But yes, first things first, we are going to head to Target. Isn't it so cute? Mm-hmm. Should we get it? Where are you gonna put it? Do you think it'll go on the front console? I think so. It's so cute. We just got this, you guys. Look how, oh shit. I thought I could do it with one hand. This looks like restoration hardware, but it's not as expensive. I knew, Studio McGee, 35 bucks. So cute. I think it's gonna look really good on the TV, uh, the coffee, the coffee table. In the living room. Room, the I think this is really cute. I like that it has um handles. This one's clean, but this has some specks of gray and black. I like that one. I more. like this one more, huh? Yeah. We also got this, and then we got some shelves, toilet paper, and this. See, it's all Studio McGee. Mm. Cause she just launched the collection. They are right. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so cute. I don't have a purpose for this. Okay, I'm like obsessed. I'm in La La Land right now. There's this white vase that I'm looking for, but I don't see it. I'm very sad. There's also this big vase. Where are you gonna put that? Mm -hmm. I don't have room for this. It's just pretty. Oh. Oh, should we get a reef? No. A reef? A reef. I hate reefs on doors. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. You never told me. Yeah, I don't like it. I just let you do it, but now it's like, no, I don't That's want so it. That's kind of you. I don't like it. That's so kind of you, babe. Only during Christmas you can put like a Christmas wreath and stuff. Oh, I agree. But like other than that, I hate wreaths. I mean, if you guys have it in your home, it's everyone's preference. I just, I, I dislike them. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, we are home. We just got home from Target. And then we also went to Stater Brothers because we needed to get the boys some um, ingredients to make their food tonight. And I also got some shrimp and stuff. Tonight I'm making like a seafood shrimp boil with some sausages and white rice, which I'm really excited about. I grab some new things at Target, which I am so thrilled that I even found these things. So if you guys don't follow Studio McGee, they're one of my favorite interior design pages to follow. You guys should definitely watch both of their shows. Actually, they have one show, but two seasons. Their second season just came out and I haven't had a chance to watch it, but I'm also like trying not to watch it until the house is unpacked because I don't want to be like inspired to buy more things but I followed them on Instagram and I saw that they launched a new collection at Target and so I was so excited I was gonna order everything and have it shipped but then I realized that the Target by our house had some of the items and they are so cute you guys I'm very impressed with one of them it's like this bowl thingy like a bowl plate thingy and it looks just like this one that I was gonna buy at restoration hardware but restoration hardware is expensive Expensive. Leave a comment down below if you guys agree. One of their bowls on there was like $500 and I was like, whoa. I also got this like vase, white vase thing and then the wood board thingy that you guys saw. And I think that I'm gonna do the long wood board plate thingy here on the console. It brings some warm vibes, but it also is going to match Carlos's new TV stand. So we originally got Carlos a new, hi baby. We originally got Carlos a new TV stand. And then when Brian and, <laughs> when Brian and, oh my God, he's such a loaf of bread. And then these two, I swear. So Jocelyn and Brian were here last week to drop off the nightstands and they mentioned, they were like, hey, if you guys don't like Carlos's new nightstand, Brian was actually gonna make Carlos, oh no, no, I'm sorry. He was like, they were like, if you guys don't like Carlos's new TV stand, Brian was thinking about gifting Carlos one that he designed and he's making. And I was like, oh my God, Carlos was there and he was so excited for it. So Brian explained it to us and there's gonna be some oak on it um, or like light wood. And I'm very excited 
excited. Brian and Jocelyn just know me so well and we are so appreciative and we're so grateful that they even thought about us. So that should be done in a few weeks and I think it's really going to tie in with how I'm doing the console. But I'm going to show you guys what I got at Target. I didn't get too many things. Honestly, we got like toilet paper and stuff. And then I got only like four decor pieces. And I'm very excited for them. But right now the boys are on me. Oh, do you guys just, you guys just hate when you have so many things to do and your dogs just like want to lay on you and cuddle. I feel like I'm just going to be sitting here for the next 15 minutes. Do you guys uh, want to see what mama got at Target? We got the loaf of bread, um, salt and pepper, um, mashed potatoes. And then I believe that you guys said that Riley also looks like salt and pepper. <laughs> Wait, no, he's the chicken tender that goes with the mashed potato. I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, but the third dog house came this week. So we are gonna build this tomorrow, and I'm hoping to show you guys the dog bed dog houses in a few days. I'm going to put this over here. I don't know why that one came so late. Let me show you guys the cute stuff that we got from Target. Okay, first and foremost, you guys saw this in my cart. I didn't even find this in the decor section, y'all. I walked into Target and someone had put this at the front register and I was like, oh my God. This is, this was $34.99 and it's by the Hearth, is it Hearth? Hearth and Hand with the Magnolia. It's a tray and I think I'm gonna put this on the console. Isn't it so pretty? This is the type of wood that I love or even a little bit lighter. And this one I got last week, but I wanna show you guys anyways. This is so beautiful. I have, I have two of these. I got two of these uh, glass vases. They're so cute. I think I'm gonna put one here. And then I also got these little plants. I have a bunch of these around the house. They are $4 each. Aren't they adorable? I'm actually gonna put it in, oh. It works out. And then I got this vase, $15, and it's so cute. Look at it, $15, it's adorable. And that this is my favorite purchase from today's Target run. It's very heavy. You guys look at this, oh my gosh. Doesn't it look like something that you can get for Restoration Hardware? This was $35 from the Studio McGee Decorative Bowl Collection. So cute, right? This I'm very excited for because I'm going to put on our coffee table in our living room in the back. That is coming on Friday. So I think not this week, but next week you guys will see the living room probably almost done. But this is gonna look, oh, I cannot explain to you. This is gonna look so freaking pretty on the coffee table because our coffee table, I got like this huge, I think it's like concrete or cement, like this huge cement cement white coffee table and it's so clean and modern. It's from CB2 and I ordered it all the way back in, I think, November or December. So it's been a while. I'm very, very excited. While Carlos is editing, this is going to be my goal for the next few hours. I'm going to organize and unbox all the boxes and we wanna clear out this whole space because our couch is coming tomorrow. And I'm very, very excited. You guys have, if you guys have been here for a while, then you know the couch has been something that we've been waiting for since November. So we're hoping to clear this whole space in the next few hours. So let's get started. Style. Even when it all looks different yeah. Even if I grow Friends, how cute are these? This was a birthday present from Brooke. She gave it to me back in October for my birthday and it's from Amazon. And how freaking cute are they? Oh, I love them. You can put anything in here. Salt, pepper, candy. Oh, Q-tips. Cotton, anything. How cute are they? They have this like light wood. Oh, I love it. We just got a delivery at the door. I'm so excited to try this out this week. This is the Hoover Power Dash Pet Carpet Cleaner. I saw this on a um, cleaning video on YouTube and it looked really good and we were um, we were looking for one. We have the Bissell one, but that one I feel like isn't powerful enough and I want something a little bit more powerful to clean the rugs. I'm very, very excited for this one. 
Is it cordless? I don't know, but I will try this out in a vlog. Let me know in the comments if you guys are interested in seeing like a cleaning video. We can try this one out together. And then I also got these baskets for the closet, which we're finishing up tomorrow. They are so cute. They're also from Target. It looks like this. Aren't they so cute, you guys? I love the color. I love how simple they are. These are gonna go in the closet to put like sandals and accessories in. They're so cute. I love them. Also, I'm thinking about putting a bowl here to put the dog's uh, leashes in because we walk the dogs out the front door. So, I don't know, and an idea, like a little bowl here. I don't know, we'll see. This is what the living room's looking like so far. We have to take care of these chairs, garage, unbox that. We have the mirror that we need to move over. All of the boxes on the left are going into the master bedroom because they're mostly clothes, shoes, and purses. I have to unbox this one. And then we have these two boxes that I need to unbox. This plant needs to go outside. Tech stuff needs to go in the studio. I am putting all the dog's toys in there um, instead of putting them in a drawer. I think I'm gonna put them in this basket because the basket's really cute. Even if something's missing, if something's missing, I'm still coming home. I'm still coming home. So sweet in knows all my strength, knows all my Random boxes. Go to the studio. Oh my god, I found Pharrell Rocher. I found Pharrell Rocher. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my god. Polaroid. Is there any film in here? There's five films in here. Baby, there's five films in here. In the Polaroid. Oh. oh, we'll have to take some later. What's here? I don't know what this is. Reminding me that I was a child. Reminding me that I, I'm coming home. I am coming home. I want to lay on these. This is what we have so far. I have all of the games. We are such game people. We have a bunch of games. This one's probably my favorite. Do or drink. Do or drink is funny. The five second rule is funny. Convo and chill. Some of these games we haven't even opened up yet. I love, before COVID, <laughs> I love game night and now it's just Carlos, Michelle and I basically for game nights. I even bought deluxe bingo back there. We thought we were gonna have a Christmas this year but then obviously 2020 didn't go out as, uh, go, didn't go as planned so hopefully at the end of 2021, we'll be able to host our family for Christmas again. I got deluxe bingo. Um, let's see. Do our drink I already talked about. I should have known that. This is a really interesting, educational, funny trivia game. Taboo is really funny. I get all of my games off of Amazon, and then these are all of the books that I have around the house. Some of them are, are readable, and then some of them are just like decor books, like you see like the Prada and the Louis Vuitton. A lot of people ask where I get those. I got a whole set of 13 designer books on Etsy for like 100 bucks, I believe, but I bought it like four years ago. 
they look like this. They're really cute to have around the house. Oh my gosh, have you guys tried this? This is the Revlon, the smaller one. You guys know how I'm obsessed with the big Revlon one. The smaller one is this one, and I'm so excited to try this. Now that I have like kind of medium long hair, I wanna try this maybe tomorrow or the day after. Let me know if you guys have tried this. Let me know if you like it. I bought it because of TikTok, and I haven't used it yet, so I'm very excited to try this out. And then Michelle bought, I believe Michelle or Brooke, I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure it's Michelle. Michelle bought the dogs these little outdoor water sprinkler thing for the summertime because our backyard will be done by then and the dogs are gonna love this. Huh, baby? Are you gonna love it? You're gonna love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Watch what he does when I stop you guys. Oh, he's not gonna do it. He usually does it. <laughs> I also get so many questions about this big mirror. This is like, I think it's seven feet or eight feet by 64 inches for the width. It's so wide and beautiful. I freaking love it. Hello. Oh, oh my God, sorry, it's so late. I got it from Anthropology. This is the Gleaming Prim Rose Mirror. They also have it in gold and I think it's gold, black, and silver, but I could be wrong. I think it's just gold and black, but I'm not sure. I love the black. I have the smaller version of this in gold and that's what's in the guest room. It's so beautiful. Okay, I decided to put the games down here. So we have all of them organized. I feel like I have more hidden in another box. I just can't find it right now. And then over here so far we have candles. You guys, you need to go on Amazon right now and buy this candle. It is so good. It's by the brand Boy Smells. And the scent is Petal. Oh my God, it is. it smells amazing. Trust me, like your house will smell so expensive. I love this. I got this for a present for my birthday from my management team and I bought two more because I'm obsessed. Okay, Michelle is swinging by. She heard that I was making really good shrimp boil, so she's swinging by to have a little bit of a late dinner. You guys, it looks so good. I'm warming it up for her right now, and then I'm warming up some white rice, and I have the cucumbers ready. It looks amazing. You guys wanna see? Yum, look at that you guys. So it's shrimp and sausage boiled in a Cajun butter seasoning. It's so good with white rice. Check out my mukbang channel if you guys wanna know the recipe. Well, you like it. Swoop the garlic, girl. When I say swoop the garlic. Hold on, I'm trying to get it as much as possible. You gotta swoop the garlic. Mmm. It's good. Here. Mm -hmm. Try with the rice. Wait, that's really good. You like it? Mm-hmm. You lying. I lie. Mm. I came here just for this. Wait, so it's a hit? It's good. Like, would you pay for mm. this shit? Would you pay for it? Wait, who needs to and grab? Oh my god, really? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, I'm onto something. Wait, the, the verdict- Next time I see you, we're gonna do this. <laughs> the verdict is the shrimp, though. No, I know. this is really good. Wait, for real? Just add some potatoes and corn. Oh, yes, 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 yes. The verdict is really the shrimp, though. You know? Wait, I'm so happy. Do you get what I mean when you when I say like you could get bread or cucumber and just dip the garlic? Mm -hmm. It you it you know like it's usually salty, but mine isn't. It's really good. You like it? This you is all I want. You can make pasta out of this. Oh my, this yeah. is like a pasta sauce too. I'm gonna have the shrimp. Well, the shrimp is the burden. If the shrimp bad, then I like you know just delete YouTube. Oh my god, it's hot. Oh, I just warmed it up for you. Did you say I delete YouTube? <laughs> I made sure they were big. They're huge. They don't have heads, so it's like your personal mukbang. It literally is. Carlos loved the sausage and rice. It's really good. I even took some of the butter and the garlic and just mixed it with rice. I would dip bread in this. Ah, <gasps> it's one of those. Yeah, you can make pasta in this. Yes. You could literally do it for anything. Yes. Ooh, pasta in it would be good. 
Brad would be good too. <laughs> it's really hot. It's really hot. Do you like the kick? I do. I feel like it could be even spicier if you wanted to. Yeah, for sure. Hmm. I don't need cake and crap anymore. <laughs> no, I truly don't. Oh my god, I'm so happy. You like? It's really good. You guys, I'm onto something. Coming we like him in a new house. <laughs> Coming soon to the Target near you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm totally just kidding. <laughs> Good morning, my loves. It is the next morning. Um, it is 8 o'clock. 9 o'clock? 9 o'clock in the morning. I got up at 8 this morning. Today's a very, very exciting day, you guys. First of all, we're going to get our coffee. But today we're doing something different. I will show you guys my favorite coffee to have at home. I love it so much. But today's a very exciting day. I'm wearing my thick filet shirt. Isn't this so cute? I forgot where I got this. Probably Amazon, to be honest. But um, the couch is coming today. Today's couch day. I cannot believe the day is finally here. I ordered this couch all the way back November 5th. It was not supposed to get here until the very last week of February. But the universe... Hard me, they said, oh my gosh, she needs a couch. So um, it's coming today, I'm very excited. And then our coffee table's coming Friday, so our living room is coming together way faster than I thought. I opened the window just now because last night I made this Cajun butter shrimp recipe, and oh my god, it was, it was so good, you guys. But the kitchen smells like Cajun shrimp. We have, like I said, the couch coming today. We are putting up a lot of frames today. Not frames, sorry. Floating shelves today. And we're hanging Carlos's TV today as well. So today a lot, there's a lot of hanging. The dog houses are also being built today, but you guys will probably not see it in today's vlog. And you probably won't see it in tomorrow's vlog. I'm thinking that you will see it in the vlog after. I'm pretty sure that's when you'll see it. And I cannot wait to film the boys' first reaction for you guys. But that is what's going on today. But first things first, we gotta get our coffee. Yeah, yeah. This is my favorite coffee found at Estata Brothers. It's the Dunkin' Iced Coffee in original. It's so good, other than if I can't get McDonald's. Dude, you guys, you know what I realized yesterday? Carlos and I were at Target and we passed a Starbucks. I haven't had Starbucks in like four weeks. Babe, do you realize that too? What? I haven't had Starbucks in four weeks. It's been a while. It's been a very long time. Babe, we're kind of coordinating. <coughs> Cheers. That's a funny shirt. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. This is more of a before and after, and then we can also get oh, it during. Really? So it would look yeah. like that, look like, or should I say that used to look like that. So that's Sharpie. Right. And, and then that was pink stuff. Right. So then she literally gave it to me, and I was like, huh, we can try it. Look, it comes off. And all, I'm not putting a lot of pressure on it or anything, and it literally just pulls it right off. Oh, you didn't get scammed. <laughs> I didn't get scammed this time. I feel like Derek is doing a commercial. Because <laughs> Sharpie is hard to get off. It is. Sharpie is 100% permanent. Especially with our walls. And your walls are white. Yeah. Oh wow, this stuff works. Oh, that's crazy. I'm going to use it everywhere now. <laughs> I'm going to use this on everything. What is this? this? The what pink is that stuff. What's stuff called? It's the, called uh, the pink stuff. The pink yeah, stuff. they call it. Um, no, 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 I'm talking about they, uh, they have. Oh, Frank's Red Hot. Oh. Uh, have you ever heard that commercial? Yeah. It's like Frank's Red Hot, I use this beep on everything. Yeah. guys love it 
Oh my gosh. So this is the Delano couch from Living Spaces. Honestly, I was a little bit nervous. I mean, we took measurements, but I didn't think it was gonna fit this good in the living room. So we centered the couch to the TV. So that's why when you guys look at this, you're like, Kim, it's not centered to the wall or to the window. But it's because we centered the couch to the TV. So when we have guests over, everybody can look at the TV perfectly. I'm leaving the mirror here because I'm gonna take bomb ass mirror shots. Hey, I'm so excited. Derek is gonna come back on Wednesday and help us mount this uh, mirror because it's ginormous. By the way, shout out to Derek for literally helping us with 99.9% .9 of this house. He's absolutely amazing and so professional, so sweet. But this is the couch right here. I love the color. I think this is called, this is called Preference Cream from Living Spaces. Again, it's the Delano. I'll actually link it down below for you guys. But I love it so much. We wanted something very comfortable, spacious, but not too big and nice and cozy. It came with way more pillows than I thought. Hey. This is my spot. No, that's my spot. This is, me, this is mine and old man's spot. It's always about you and old man, whatever. Or Cooper. Oh, or wow. Wow. I mean, or Riley or Casper. Okay, so all the dogs. Whoever decides to sleep with me. Whatever. This you is the, you, you guys, honestly. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> the couch looks so good. We're gonna get couch covers for every day, and then when we have like guests and stuff, we'll take it off. But yeah, so cute. Oh my god, I'm literally so obsessed right now. And it's so comfortable, huh, babe? It is. Like, extremely comfortable. If you guys are looking for a good couch, this is it. So our coffee table is gonna go right here. And our coffee table is this one from CB2, and I believe it's custom cement. It's so pretty. And we're thinking about a rug. So we're thinking about a rug, you guys. We definitely need a rug. I think it's gonna make the space really cozy. I think we need a rug. Yeah, it for looks, sure. Uh, even with the coffee table, it's gonna look a little bare. I'm so excited. So we need to look for a rug. Yeah. This looks so nice. Derek helped us mount these floating shelves. I'm not gonna keep the decor like this. Hello, but this is the beginning of the vibe in... <laughs> Riley, the beginning of the vibe in this bathroom. It's so cute, I love it. And then we also have the shelves here above the toilet. These light wood floating shelves are from Target. These are like the smaller versions. Hello. Show the new couch, Ry. Oh, hello, it looks so good. Oh my gosh, you guys, so grand. And then we also put the shelves in the laundry room where we can organize the detergents and stuff because I was not able to reach up here. We're gonna organize up here. So this will be like a project in itself, but I'm very excited. And then Carlos would like to show you the office. Yeah, I decided to have my TV mounted. So he also mounted my TV, well, my monitor, quote unquote. So we got the TV mounted, we got the plaques up. No, I'm glad I did it. Well, not We're like back. me, but like I'm glad I had it mounted. I told you since the beginning, I'm like, hey, it's gonna look better mounted. <laughs> I think <laughs> it's so funny that you lie. <laughs> I love when you lie to subscribers and you lie to me and you just lie to the world. Look, you guys, I went to go buy dishwasher uh, soap detergent or whatever mm -hmm. and bought her some chocolate because she likes this. Okay. So I love you. Oh, babe. No, whatever. <laughs> also mounted the diploma and I'm gonna get a new frame for the diploma I'm gonna get like a black one and then this is my office area mounted these two frames above here which I still got to put art in and then my other plaque is over there and I'm gonna put this right above the TV right yes here. yes Carlos is gonna put that little are you gonna do it here now um, I'll do it in a bit a okay little touch, a little touch you know a little personal touch <laughs> you know it's a little small personal touch okay but it's gonna look good Whatever. And then in our um, master bathroom, we got these shelves from Target mounted. They're just white and they have, I think they're used for like frames and stuff, but we are going to put our perfumes and skincare stuff here. So I think it's gonna look really good. I love these, they're so nice. Carlos actually went with these. I was gonna put like acrylic ones, but he was like, no, 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 babe, we gotta do white. It's gonna look so good. Hi, hello. Hello. I was just telling our subscribers how you chose this and it looks awesome. Yes. Better than the acrylics. Yes, you're right. You're so right. It looks really good. Yeah. What are you gonna put here? Like skincare, all that good stuff. Even though you have this medicine cabinet. Oh, I thought this was for you. No, no, that's all you. That's for, I mean, it can be for both of us. You can put your beard stuff. I'll probably put my beard stuff there and then I'll probably put like colognes and stuff here. Yeah. Because I don't really use them that often. Yeah. 
the perfumes and stuff, colognes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like you have one right here. Wow, you haven't even used this one yet, bubs. Because I have the other one still. I oh. still have the other one that's, uh, you, you guys. Hey, do you want the top two shelves because I'm shorter? Sure. You should put that on top. Hey, if any of you are looking for a cologne for your boyfriend or whoever, your dad, any male figure in your, fa in your life, you guys should try this one. I what is it one. called? It's, pol it's Polo Red. Oh. It's literally just Polo Red. Well, I wouldn't have known. What? Everyone knows a little Polo uh, symbol. Ew. Mm, that's nice. Would it look better on top? Ew. <laughs> I love that cologne. That's like my favorite. Do you have anything else? I have Versace. Go. I think you left your other one in the bathroom. Ooh, smell it. Oh, that this, one smells good. This, uh, my sister gave me this one, or gifted me this one. Ew. Wait, I want to put my skincare. Yeah. Nice. Oh, we look like a Sephora, baby. You're looking like a Sephora. Yeah. What else do I have? I don't have anything else, to be honest. I'm, like, really into Drunk Elephant. I love Drunk Elephant, y'all. Ew. Yeah. Ew. Oh my god, we look like we have a store. I love it. It looks so good. It's killing me how yours look. I don't know, mine's more aesthetically pleasing. Well, I'll be, I'm not just gonna leave it like that. I still have to organize. <gasps> uh, I'm just kidding. Yeah, Bubba. Wow, well, doesn't that look good? I love this. Nice. This is my favorite oil. What is it, Drunk Elephant? Yeah, I love Drunk Elephant. It's all dusty from the move. Yeah, nice. Wait, I'm so glad that you chose this shelf. I was gonna go with the ugly ass acrylic one. <laughs> Alrighty, you guys, we are gonna end the vlog here today. Hey, you can see me in the back. What's up, you guys? We're gonna actually start tomorrow's vlog right now, right after this, but we wanted to show you guys the new couch in this one. Don't forget to subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Leave a comment down below. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow morning with a brand new vlog. And yes, what are we doing tomorrow? Oh, tomorrow's the closet, and then the day after we're doing the dog houses, I believe. So, bye, love you. Bye.